I'm Jennifer Crane, and I'm the program chair for the Master's in Counseling Psychology Department here at Sophia University. I'm Adrian Erslan, and I'm a core faculty member here at the Master's in Counseling Psychology program at Sophia University. The Master's in Counseling Psychology program at Sophia University is WASC accredited. It also combines the scientific study of counseling psychology, transpersonal psychology, creative expressive therapy, and movement-based approaches, all while aligning the personal and professional development of becoming a clinician. The Masters of Counseling Psychology program at Sophia University works to understand the ways that uh, the mental health profession and field has been shaped by larger social constructs uh, and systems. So we work to try and help provide students with the tools to explore and unpack those concepts, concepts around privilege, identity, uh, social structures of oppression, better understand how they can be more equitable and inclusive clinicians. We're also working as administrators to really understand how that even shows up in the classroom experience. The program is designed for cohort-based learning. Students can reside in approved states, regions, and other countries in the world in order to be able to attend Sophia University. Most of the learning is done actually asynchronous and online, but some of the learning is done on campus or on a video platform format. So twice a year, students are either online on a video format with their professors and cohort mates learning together in that fashion, or you may come to campus for a 10-day intensive experience and learn with your professors and cohort mates in many experiential ways. Many modalities of learning happen then. When I first went to therapy school, I really had no idea what it was like to be in a long-term profession of being a therapist. I really wanted to be in a program where I knew that I was going to better myself, that I was going to learn how to deal with me and deal with the pressures and the stressors of the world out there so that I could make better decisions and stay in sort of a positive state of change for myself. What I learned along the way of being a therapist is that I am a third party objective voice of reason in the room for somebody. And the fact that I learned how to get out of my way and how to really truly sit and be present with the client experience as I'm present with my own experience and knowing that I can deal with that later if I get triggered or overwhelmed and stay in consciousness and therapeutic presence with the clients is, that's the reason that I think my clients keep coming back. They feel safer in a container with me and they can really explore all of the things they want to because we've built trust and rapport. They understand that I'm not going to be judging them, that I'm really truly trying to understand their experience and helping hold up the mirror for them so that they can, I can listen to them and listen for them and reflect back to them. When I went to my therapy school, 10 years ago, I thought I defined being a therapist as just helping people. Now I have a little bit more of a nuanced perspective on what that means exactly. Now I think of it as being able to sit with a huge range of human conditions, experiences, traumas, strengths, all of it. And finding my own strength and being able to hold a container where we can accept and welcome and explore all of that together. And once I'm able to sit with people and we can look unflinchingly and compassionately at their deep truths, then we get to make choices about what to do with that. And being able to help people decide how they want to grow, how they want their lives to be, is the most profound collaboration possible. So at Sophia University, we want to help provide students with the tools not only to sit with that broad range of human experience, but also to be able to define what being a therapist means for you. If you want to learn to become a therapist, if you want to learn how to get out of your way and really truly be present with yourself and for somebody else and the world, come to Sophia University. Come and have the experience of the Masters in Counseling Psychology Department. And even if you don't decide to become a therapist, you're going to be a better person in this world.